Good morning, afternoon, and evening, guys. We are back to our regularly scheduled random tier list. Though I suppose this isn't too, too random because I am back with another Smite video. And we are doing this because this has been requested multiple times. I've gotten at least three, I think, different comments on my videos asking me to do the God, the Norse. Is he Norse? I think he's Norse. The Norse. Yeah, the Norse. The Norse God Ymir, who when I first heard the name, I definitely thought it was a woman. And that's because I watched Attack on Titan. But that has nothing to do with this, actually. Just the same name. Ymir, Norse God, father of the Frost Giants, according to the website, which I will be using to not look like an utter... F well, I'll, I'll still look like a fool, let's be honest. Um, so yeah, let's, we're going to go ahead and go with Ymir. Uh, we're going to do the first skin first, which for some reason is down here. Standard Ymir, I think, is a pretty cool skin. I'm going to put it A tier. Um, big ice snow giant here. Um, with a big hammer coming down. Yeah, I like that. Good stuff. Baron Frostchild here. It's Ymir, but with a a violin. Um, it's not bad. It's uh, it's uh, it's good. It, like it's unique. It's it's a cool design. Um, not as cool as the original, in my opinion. Um, I I wouldn't use it as quickly. Um, but it's definitely not bad. This is bad. Bellyache. Um, they made him into a, a they made him an ice cream because he's a snow giant get it ha snow ice yeah um why is part of the cookie on his crotch eaten why is there a giant cherry shoved into his belly button i have more questions about this skin and i don't want the answers to them moving on bloody butcher this skin is awesome i think it's s tier it might i might move it down to top of a tier but it's at least, uh, it's going to be put in S tier for now. Looks very, very cool. Um, I'm not sure if this was a Halloween type skin or whatever, but it, it looks epic. I don't know what else to say. Next, we have a Twitch skin. And there's actually two of these. There's, botch tw there's Boss Twitchy Mirror. And there is Twitchy Mirror. And they look very, very similar. I'm going to put them both in C tier just to, to compare them. I actually think Twitchy Mirror without the Boss looks really cool. Um, I like how the logo is just in the ice. I like how it's purple. The regular one doesn't look as good, in my opinion, and that might just be the lighting. So um, some of you guys in the comment section of my Smite videos have told me that um, all of the skins have different, like, um, uh, effects around their attacks and stuff. And despite the the art on this being different, it does look like these guys would have uh, similar effects. So I'm going to put them next to each other, but I'm going to put this one ahead because um, I do think that it is uh, a better image. Next, we have uh, Kaka Demon, C4 Code Demon. I don't know. This one, oh, actually, these next three are kind of all the same thing. So they're all Kako Demon, and then we have Kako Demon X, and then Kako Demon, but the A is a four. I don't know what any of that means. And I also don't know the difference. I've been staring at this for a while. I don't know the difference between these two green ones. They look exactly the same to me. So that might just be in their exclusivity, how they're received. Um, maybe one was available from a limited mint, not mint, um, you know, drop or, or some other way. Um, so yeah, these ones aren't bad. In fact, they look good. Um, the stomachs are a little, like, it almost looks like you can see their intestines. Um, but it looks cool. It looks, uh, yeah, it looks bad, eh? It looks like it's about to, to, to fight somebody, rip somebody's head off. I think I do like the green one more than this one, and I am going to keep Twitchimon ahead of it. So, A tier for me. Um, yeah, bottom of A tier so far. Next, we have Crystal Colossus. This one's going to be top of B tier for me. It is good. Um, the I really like the armor. I really like the color. The shape of the head is a little odd. I kind of wish they had kept the beard. Um, I thought that I think that would look great. Um, so B tier, not bad by any means. Next we have Digimir nine thousand. This is like a digital version. Um, this one I'm going to put in C tier. I do like the concept of him becoming like a computer um, cyborg type thing, um, but the the design kind of has his his upper body is just a lot bigger than his lower body, and I guess that's the case with some of the other skins. But just in this one, it just looks weird. So I'm going to put it C tier. Not bad, but definitely average. You guys know, C tier about average. B above average. A good and, you know, S great. And then D tier is whatever the heck this is. 
Freezy Chibi looks really good. Um, this is probably one of the best Chibi skins I've seen, honestly. Um, in fact, I think I'd use it over the regular one, so I think I'm going to put this in S tier. Um, it's a really nice Chibi skin. They 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 made him Chibi without making him look stupid. Um, so I like that. Next, we have Gecko Guardian. This one is interesting. Um, I don't mind it. It's a very interesting take on, like, there's a Gecko controlling this, you know, giant... Well, I guess now it's not ice, it's water. Um, but this giant Colossus, there's a Gecko there. That's interesting. I'm not sure where the origins of that concept come from, or if they come from anywhere. Um, so it's a good skin. It's B tier. Um, I don't think it's as cool as these ones in A tier, who are all, like, super, super, like cool. I keep saying cool. I need to come up with a different adjective. Um, but these ones are just more epic than this. This is, it's cute. It's interesting, um, but it's going to be here in B2. Next, we have the normal golden skin. I actually think the normal golden skin is really, really good. I'm not sure if I've had a normal skin in S tier so far, but I think the normal skin is actually better than the standard skin, um, though it is not as well detailed. So let me know in the comment section if you use the golden skin, are the effects as good as this one, as the normal standard skin? Because the picture of the standard skin is a much higher resolution, which makes me want to put it up here. But I'm trying not to base it off that because I know in game it's probably going to look different. Next, we have a Resumir. Um, this one's going to be C tier for me. Um, she looks like a big, burly, muscular hefty dude in a loincloth. Um, it's probably more to the skin. There's definitely some lore behind the skin. I don't know it, though. C tier. Nuclear Winter looks awesome. Um, Going to be up here right next to Bloody Butcher. Not much more to say. It just looks great. Obsidian Shard also looks awesome. This is my favorite skin that I've seen so far. Um, I like how they made the uh, head into like a bull's head, but still kept the beard. Um, and now the ice has turned like black. So that's very cool. Next we have striking Machina also going to be S tier. I take back what I said, striking Machina is not my favorite. Um, very cool design for kind of an earth golem with some magical powers or machine type things. A, a nice combination there. It looks like a magic and technology. Titan forge is also very good. Titan forge is going to be at the very top of A tier for me. Um, yeah, it looks better than the original skin. And in fact, I think it looks better than golden skin too. So I think I'm going to move golden skin down here to A tier. I think that's fair. So Titan Forge here. Cool looking skin. Love the armor. Reminds me of World of Warcraft uh, Paladin armor. Looks good. And then finally, we have Walking Blight. Uh, definitely a cool skin. Does not really fit in my brain the Emir I said. Now, I just learned who Emir was 10 minutes ago. So maybe I'm not qualified to say that. This skin is definitely cooler than the B tier, though. It is definitely cooler than these ones. I think I am going to go ahead and move these ones down into B tier here um, to be fair to my A tiers here to give them the proper recognition. Because I think this skin is probably going to be up here um, at the top of A tier, probably right underneath Titan Forge um, with my S tiers remaining what they are. And my, it looks like my C and D tier are going to remain what they are because that's all our skins. So it looks like we only had one we didn't like, Bellyache. Um, this thing is concerning. Um, and then we have five S-tier skins. Have we had five in a video before? I have no idea. Uh, but yeah, some pretty good skins for Amir. Let me know in the comment section who you guys want to... Uh, let me know in the comment section who you guys want to see next. If you have another um, champion or god from a game that you think I would really like to do... I will be doing some more Smite videos later this week, but I will probably take a break for a couple days to get some other content out there. But don't worry, it will be back, because as you guys know, I make a video every single day, noon Pacific coming out. If you'd like to see more videos like that, along with a couple streams here and there, we'll see how that goes. My first one on Saturday went well. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel and um, a like, comment, all that good stuff. All right, And thank you guys for watching. This has been the guy that makes random tier lists. Signing off.